to the Nerdy Fitness Vlog with your host, Pablo Gunner. And uh, today I'm going to just be talking about, like, you know, what's went on on my weekend and stuff, as well as, you know, this beginning of this week of, you know, workout and food and all that business. So, so I did the bike, and what did I have to eat? Oh, yeah, so... I got, the wife got me these new bars. They're Julie's Organic. And they are at Costco. She got me two boxes. They're strawberry. Delicious. The best freaking uh, bars ever. So, yeah, it was fantastic. Unfortunately, I didn't have anything else, but the wife made me burritos. So I should have burritos for the rest of the week that are sausage and some organic sausage and um, egg but anyways so yeah so went to work did the bike and so I was like I need to make, step up the challenge and and everything like that too so I did so I was like okay so I had a lot of continuing with the arm circles as well as you know doing intermittent like uh, the jabs and the hooks and the uppercuts between each one you know arm circles front side up above you know and I did those for, I did it a minute straight, you know, just like one of, of each. And then, so with each, when I do points, you know, like it's a point one or, you know, a point something, a point, you know, when I goes up a full, uh, like point one, point two, like each time I knock the resistance up until I got to the max resistance, which is 22. So 22 is the max resistance. I got up to 22. And then once I got up to 22, I was like, okay, now I'm going to, I'm gonna go down, and so I'll decrease the resistance for each point, you know, that I do, and, but I'm gonna stop at 10, so I'm gonna keep it at 10, and I went the whole, in the whole way, like, my arms were freaking tired by the time I finished, uh, so, and I did get more than I did last time, so I made it difficult, more difficult for myself, because it was at, um, yeah, point 10, or I think, I want to say the re no the resistance was 10 is what it was that's what I had it at uh, resistance was 10 is what I left it at and so that's what I had for majority of the run I like I said once I de decreased so and I, I got 7.69 in 30 minutes uh, I was like damn it so close to 7.7 .7. it was like right after the 30 30 mile like I hit that 7.7 uh, .7. so technically I did it but not within the 30 minutes it was just barely over so but yeah so it was good first push myself further made it harder you know and I'm gonna continue doing that make it a little bit harder each time and try to improve each time instead of just you know yeah make it harder and try to improve so yeah and then this morning I actually got off late and I had a doctor's appointment and I wasn't sure if I was supposed to fast or not so I not only that like I forgot to eat just because I was so busy doing uh, uh, work on the computer. So I kind of like lost track of time and was like, oh crap, I forgot to eat my salad. Uh, it's like a Southwestern with, with chicken uh, salad. Maybe I should just eat my yogurt or something. It was too late because then my relief got there at a, at a decent time. And so then I went and I got out and then I had a doctor's appointment. So I had a doctor's appointment. I had to go to that. It was It's for work. Uh, so I was getting paid for it, but I was like, oh man, this is really cutting into my workout time. I was hoping I could get, so my appointment was until 8.30 and I got out at 8. So I was like, oh, do I have enough time? And I was like, no, my workouts have been going over at 30 minutes. So I better not. And then it's factoring in with changing. It takes me about, you know, 10 minutes or whatever. So I was like, yeah, I don't want, I don't want to risk it. So I just went to the appointment and of course appointments take forever when you show up early the thing is because I hadn't eaten I was like my energy was pretty low like I was snacking on these pretzel crisps but that really wasn't enough like it didn't it gave me the nutrients you know I had no substance I need some meat I need some protein you know yes I was looking for something lighter like a salad or like uh you know yogurt um and throwing some granola protein uh in there and stuff but uh, it didn't work out. So, but like I said, I just had the crisps, and I, I probably wasn't, uh, I, I was decently hydrated. So, I went and I did the workout anyways. I was like, screw it. I'm going to do this workout. 
but I re-orchestrated uh, my workouts because I want it so that at the end of my week, I want my workouts to be finishing with yoga. Like, you know, I, I realized that, like, it's best if I start with yoga so that, like, uh, you know, over the weekend, anything that was, you know, any kinks or whatever, you, well, I'll get loose doing yoga you know, doing yoga and then doing upper body, that upper, mostly upper body cardio, you know, next day abs, and then we'll be, and then the third day will be the more hardcore intense um, cardio, which is better, I think, because you like build, it's building up, you know, you're building up and then kind of going down, you know, kind of like a roller coaster, so to speak, you know, it's like, you're going to build up, you're going to build up, you know, oh, it's really intense. And then, you know, you have that, uh, so like it's easier at the end of the week so that at the end of your week you have the easier abs as well as the easier uh, Cardio the you know the upper body cardio because you will be sore you, it's, it's, Like I said because the other cardio is super intense and like I said, if you do what I do Which is also do you know cardio in the evenings you whether it's the bike or running or whatever You know then you're you're doubly sore from cardio so it's good to have it at the end of the week and also loosen up. Do I like I said I love doing the yoga to loosen up at the end of my week. So that's really really nice to do. Um, and so what I had for and also yeah what I had was a salmon burger. I had this wheat or organic wheat bun. It was freaking delicious. I didn't have cheese. I didn't have lettuce. I didn't have tomato. I didn't have anything else. That's all I had. Hopefully tomorrow I'll be able to have all the accoutrement, but this time I didn't, but I did have green beans with it, so that was really good, you know, have a bite of that, and then a fork of, of green beans, so it was really good, still have half a thing of green beans left, and, you know, like I said, I pre-made the, the, another patty, because I wasn't sure if I was going to do a double today, or if I was going to get overtime today, in fact, there was one, and I was like, oh, I think they might get me for this, so, um, but yeah, it worked out, so I was able to, able to do my workout today. So uh, yeah, it's I, I'm I'm actually I think what I might start doing is just going like, hey, if if I can't do one in the in the morning, like if one gets skipped over, I'm not gonna go ahead and just go like, oh, I'm still gonna do my bike or my run at night. No, I'm just gonna do the actual workout instead. Like those these workouts, I feel since I'm testing them on myself are more important than, hey, the running, you know, so, uh, yeah, um, that's, that's it, you know, uh, that's, that's all, so, oh, I did have an apricot after two, and so here's this nerdy little fact, for those people that do not like the part, because there's this, there's this one girl on YouTube or Facebook, and she, she irritated the crap out of me, because she was like, I hate the joke in Civil War that Ant-Man makes when he says, does anybody have any orange slices? Well, if you know, uh, orange slices are really good if you're working out, if you're building muscle. They're real, they're, they're, because they have a lot of amino acids, they they help your muscles a lot, like repair and rebuild um, after a workout. And because he went giant, it like that's what it did to his muscles, and that's why he says that. That's why he's says does anybody have any orange slices so it's a bit it's kind of like a fitness nerd thing uh to know that so if you don't know that you don't really get that joke i still thought it was funny i just thought it was delivered funny but i also knew the the, the fitness aspect of it too the the you know so uh so that's why so i that's why that's another reason i had i figure okay i don't i don't actually know if it cuts have amino acids i'm just assuming because it's like a citrusy brew uh that it does Maybe somebody can look that up for me, or maybe I'll look it up myself. Uh, so yeah, and the wife also got me some apple slices, so I'm gonna probably eat that as well. And I also have the little snack pack. I'm not sure if I can eat, if I'm gonna eat both. Um, but yeah, so uh, that's it for me for now. So make sure you stay fit, stay healthy, stay nerdy. And I think I don't have a question, whatever. So yeah, love and peace.